Windows 8 doesn't always come with an icon for the old classic Internet Explorer on the desktop. This is the classic Internet Explorer that you used to use in previous versions of Windows. So how do you get this icon on the screen? Well really it's quite simple. First of all we need to hold our finger down on the Windows key. The Windows key is located between the CTRL key and the ALT key on your keyboard. With this key held down, tap the letter R for Romeo on your keyboard. This will bring up a run window. In this run window, we need to type the following command. I for India, E for Echo, X for X-Ray, T for Papa, L for Lima, O for Oscar, R for Romeo, D for Echo, full stop, E for Echo, X for X-Ray, E for Echo. When we've done this, click OK. Internet Explorer will now load up. And you'll also notice along the bar at the bottom of the screen is the blue E just here. If we move our mouse over this blue E, and then click the right mouse button once, you'll see a menu appears. We need to move our mouse up to pin this program to the taskbar, then left click once. We can now shut down Internet Explorer by clicking on the red cross at the top right hand corner of the Internet Explorer window. As you'll notice, the E for Internet Explorer remains on the taskbar and we can open up Internet Explorer from there whenever we like. So we'll just give it a test. And yep, that's fine, that opens up. Let's close down Internet Explorer again. Another way we can do this is by creating a desktop shortcut. So move your mouse over an empty area of the desktop, left click once, and a menu appears. Move your mouse down to New, and then across to Shortcut, and left click once. A Create Shortcut box will open up. Left click once in the box below, type the location of the item. Now we need to type the following command. C for Charlie, then a colon, followed by a backslash. Then we need to type program space files and then a backslash and then internet space explorer and then another backslash now we need to type i e x p l o r e full stop E X E. I'll give you a few seconds just to check to make sure that you've copied this correctly. Now we need to click left click the next button. And we need to give our shortcut a name, so I'm just going to simply type Internet Explorer. But this can be anything you like. OK, so let's click left click finish. And there we have it, an icon for Internet Explorer. And we can move this icon to wherever we like on the screen by holding down the left mouse button dragging the icon to where we want to place it and then let go in of the left mouse button and we'll just check it works by double clicking on it
and there we go internet explorer is loaded and that's all there is to it